I coded for 150 hours in 90 days. At one point, I completely gave up. I stopped coding for almost three weeks, but then I came back and I built multiple websites, got calls from recruiters, an interview, and even spoke with a vice president of a talent acquisition. Oh, and I also started YouTube. Here's how it happened. First, let's talk about the numbers. I coded for 150 hours across 90 days. That's around an hour and 40 minutes of coding every single day. Some days I worked for five hours, others I didn't touch my laptop. But that uneven effort still got me somewhere. At first, I was consistent. I was building, experimenting, trying things out. But after about 40 days, I burned out and I quit. I stopped coding for nearly three weeks. It wasn't planned. I just didn't want to touch my project again. I thought I was done. I didn't feel like programming was bringing me joy anymore. It wasn't something I was interested in doing. But then I decided to show some of my projects and websites to some of the people I know. I showed it to my family, I showed it to my friends, I showed it to my teachers, I also showed it to some recruiters. And hey, guess what? Their reactions? That's what hit me. I realized I actually liked what I was creating, so I came back. And when I did, everything started to connect. After I came back, I built 14 full websites, each one better than the last. I started putting them out there and people noticed. That's how I got a call from a recruiter, an interview, and I even got to talk with a vice president of talent acquisition, all from showing up again. Around the same time, I started YouTube. I didn't even have a plan, I just wanted to show my work. In 28 days, I went up in 80 subscribers. In total, I have 140 subscribers, and every upload taught me something new about storytelling, editing, and just doing the work and showing up every day. And then the real world stuff happened. I went to a career expo, joined tech calls, and kept learning from every conversation while also learning new technologies and tools in programming. None of it was planned, but all of it came from the momentum. If there's one thing I learned from 150 hours of coding in 90 days, it's that consistency isn't about never stopping. It's about starting again after you stop. Burnout didn't kill my progress. Quitting didn't define me. Coming back did. So yeah, I coded for 150 hours and 90 days. I built 14 websites, started YouTube, got real world opportunities, and found my motivation again. You don't need to be perfect, you just shouldn't give up. If this connected with you, subscribe and let's keep building together.